coaches are their own enemies, and that could be the reason why AFC Lepas, Gurmai, and the larger extend the national team Arambi Stars seem to have faith in foreign coaches. Interim AFC Lepas coach James Nandwa, who took the reins of leadership in one of the hottest seats in the Kenyan football, is asking for patience during his tenure as he tries to navigate through the six remaining league matches. KTN senior sports reporter Hassan Juma puts that story into perspective. After the national team coaching seat, the next demanding football coaching job is the two biggest community-based clubs, FC Leopards and Gormahia. The three jobs have been the preserve of foreign coaches, but after Belgian Luke Aimel was shown the door in favor of James Nandwa, the former Kenyan international is well aware that it will not be rosy at the Leopards' den. I'm going to work hard because it's a hot seat everywhere. If you don't perform, there's a problem. However, according to Nando, local coaches are to blame for the influx of foreign coaches in Kenya. Nando is of the view that once a local coach shows his worth, an element of envy sets in. Nando was unveiled on Wednesday, and as he exchanged pleasantries with his new charges, his employers are asking for patience for the new man at the helm. We know he can deliver. We know he's been in football uh, circles in Kenya for quite some time. With six league matches and the Go TV Cup to go, Nando has not given up hope of clinching the league dead him. Interim coach James Nando was unveiled today and he's asking the fans to be patient as he tries to cobble up a winning outfit. I'm going for KTN from KTTC. I'm Hassan Juma.